I love y'all too. <laughs> I prepared all year for this. I am Assemblywoman Diana Richardson. And today, graduates, you will join me in becoming a proud alumni of Mega Evers College. Nine years ago, I was where you were today. So as you go on to the next phase of your life, I've come in this moment to give you some advice. Never be jealous of your fellow man. Hold on, because half of the time, they're just fronting from the gram. It is important to understand that social media is not social. Your worth is not determined by how many online friends you have. Don't get caught up in this life of hashtags, Snapchats, and retweets. Know that your personal and your virtual presence online will follow you for a lifetime. So don't go posting foolishness online. And then question, hold on. You post the foolishness online and then question why it's going down in your DM. Okay? But to be serious, things are changing all around us and all of us are affected. But if you follow the path of our ancestors, you'll never have to be redirected. Channel the spirit of Mega, who moved fearlessly, even when the path didn't seem so clear. Learn to negotiate like Dr. King. And if you have to go to great lengths to stand up for what you believe in, then do that. Move with the militant and the discipline of Malcolm. Do not let them fool you about Malcolm. It is time to get organized. Do not depend on the media's 15 second sound bite as a source of your news. No offense, Miss Brazil, but I'm talking to my, 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 my students and I gotta keep it real, okay? <laughs> I encourage you to read and research to obtain your own understanding. Your education will bring opportunities for you to create change. We cannot stand by and watch another man like Eric Gardner plead, plead that he cannot breathe. We cannot stand by and watch another youth like Mike Brown get gunned down in the street we cannot stand by and watch our young men like Trayvon get gunned down because he had on a hoodie. Think about that. Before we consistently band together as African American people to tackle the injustices in our society. <sighs> it is important to understand the value of the African-American life, the value of the African-American family, the value of the African-American man. I love you, black men. It is time for us to get civic-minded. Remember, what you say says a lot about you, but sometimes it's what you don't say that says so much more. There can be no more looking at the newspaper and becoming upset. There can be no more mumbling at the TV. We have to mobilize and you have to understand that we must do it swiftly. I am counting on your success because I am truly counting on you to join me. Understand in life that no time will be the perfect time. Don't wait for the perfect moment. You take the moment and you make it perfect. The road ahead of you will get rough, but fortunately, you are mega made. 
That's right. In life, you may fall down, but you must understand that you have to get back up. So when things get tough and it seems like you can't beat the odds, know it is out of your hands and trust in God. And finally, carry yourself with dignity and respect. Remember, what you give out is what you project. Your smile is your logo. Your personality is your business card. And how someone feels after an encounter with you will become your trademark. So if you master these things, you will go very far. Congratulations. Yeah.